Yes. Inspector Villiers and Sergeant McManus are here to see you, Doctor. Send them in. Come in, come in. Please sit down. Some tea. Oh, thank you. Uh, I'd like some tea, please. Uh, maybe not, no thanks. Maybe later. No problem. No, thank you, Doctor. Well, then, what can I do for Scotland Yard? Uh, we understand the Kessler boy has regained consciousness. Uh, sorry. Sorry. Has Mr. Kessler said anything regarding the attack on the Moors? Excuse me. Yes? Roger Matheson, Doctor. Oh, not here. He's on the telephone. Well, tell him I'm out. Tell him I've passed away. Uh, an old war wound. <laughs> Just tell him I'm dead. No more calls. I'm sorry if I conflict with your report, Inspector, but Jack and I were not attacked by a man. Mm, so you've said. You may have a point, sir. Two strong boys would be able to defend themselves against one man. Sergeant McManus, are you suggesting that David and Jack were in fact attacked by some animal and that the official de Mavis Proctor has conspired to keep it a secret? We have an autopsy report on the murderer who was shot in the act by the local police. We have two witnesses to the crime. Now, you'll forgive me, Mr. Kessler, if I consider your testimony as coming from someone who's gone through a terrible shock. Inspector, the boy seems all right to me and... Damn what, sir? And I don't rightly know, sir. That is precisely my point. David, as far as we're concerned, the matter is now closed. We will trouble you enough further. Good day. Doctor. 